Welcome to the Life's Necessities and Luxuries radio show. Today, our host, Dawn Marie Nutel, your life's commodities broker, will bring you fashion, beauty tips, business acumen, teach you where to find the life's greatest necessities and the finest luxuries. Now, here's Dawn Marie. Hello, my lifers. Welcome back to another episode of Life's Necessities and Luxuries. I'm your host, Dawn Marie Mutel, and today we're going to cover a necessity, and that is sun care. Right now, summer's here, summertime fun, going to the beach, playing in the park, doing all that fun, fun stuff. Don't want you to think about forgetting to put on the sun care, okay? You know, you want to protect your skin because the sun rays out there are really, really bad. And you don't want to get skin cancer. You don't want to have any premature aging. I've seen my dad go through skin cancer and it wasn't fun. And, you know, he was very fair skin. He's very fair. And so he loved being out in the sun. And it always bothered him that he wasn't able to just tan. Like my mom, she was Hispanic and so she had... Uh, you know, olive skin. And in the summer when she would bathe in the sun, she would just get really, you know, brown like a nut. So I kind of have both. Like I remember one time when I went to Mexico with my uh, friends from high school and we were all on this, on this high school trip together. And it was February and we all wanted to be in the sun so badly from the winter, you know, in New York. And so we're just putting baby oil on our skin and the teachers came by and like, uh, girls, you know, you look like you're burning over there. And we're like, nah, we're fine. Well, the four of us were in bed, burnt like lobsters when everybody else was going out to dinner and going dancing. So don't let the sun ruin the fun. Okay, so you want to make sure you're using at least, I like to say 15 or higher, but I really like to say 50 or higher especially on your face. You know, you want to have a separate one. I used to use one by Clinique that was really great. They also have one that's for the lip and for under the eyes. Um, Those balms were really great. I think they were like SPF 50. I started using one that's 110, I think it is, by Neutrogena. It's very inexpensive. It's like $12 for a large bottle and it lasts for a number of months. So you can really get good use out of that. And you want to make sure that that they say that they're waterproof or water resistant because if you're going to be playing in the ocean and the water and the lake and the pond or whatever it is, you want to make sure that it's not going to wash right off of your skin and then you're still going to be susceptible to getting burned. So make sure that you have something that's maybe sport proof or waterproof and keep reapplying it. Every, I think it's like 80 minutes, it only lasts. So make sure that you keep an eye on the time because, you know, when you're out having fun, we forget about these things. So I don't want you to burn. The other thing I like to do is just have a nice big umbrella on the beach so that, you know, you're not stuck out there in the sun. And I found um, a chair that has like a canopy hangs right over. I get to stay out as long as I want because I don't feel like I'm getting baked and it's a really great thing. I found it many, many years ago at a CVS down in Clearwater Beach and I've been using them ever since. I have not been able to find them lately, so I don't know if they stopped making them or not, but um, I remember buying two of them and so I'm glad I did because thankfully they're still okay to use. So if you see anything, maybe you can get a clip-on umbrella to put on your chair, on your beach chair. If you have a lounge chair, you could probably put it at the back and clip it over so that at least you have some coverage. And they have those fun little tents that you can just roll up and pop out, and they're so cool. I think they were selling them at Sam's Club or was it Walmart? One of those I had asked someone on the beach one day, because it's really fun that you can kind of hang out in there. If you're somebody who tends to burn, or you just don't like being in the sun. I don't like being in the sun. I like being outside, but I don't like the sun baking on me. So find your sweet spot and find the things that you can use so that you can enjoy outside and have fun. Because you know what, if you live in a place where it's, you know, you get all the seasons, Summer is such a short amount of time. It's going to be gone before you know it. So take advantage. You have till like probably October to be able to have fun. And you can still go to the beach in October. You may not be going in the water, but you can still be outside, right? And you can still be enjoying yourself. And you may not be in, even in your bikini. You could just be in a pair of shorts and a t-shirt or a tank top or whatever you prefer. So get outside, have some fun, get some fresh air. You know, the sun has vitamin D, which is really important for our bodies. A lot of us are deficient in vitamin D, and vitamin D is very, very crucial in a lot of different areas of our bodies. So they say to lift your face up to the sun so that it can hit, which is where your thyroid is, which is what will help bring in that vitamin D. You can also take a supplement, too, 
But um, you want to get it from the sun because that's its natural form. And there's some foods that you can take. I can't remember what they are right now that do have vitamin D in it. They say like, uh, I think it's like milk and some cereals have vitamin D in it. I think eggs are another good source of vitamin D. You can look that up. That's all I'm going to leave you with because I want you to have fun this season. I want you to, you know, get outside, have fun, meet your friends, meet your family, or go solo. I mean, I like going to the beach alone a lot because it gets me time to think and quiet down and... I don't have somebody talking in my ear all the time. You know, it's, I don't mind having people talk, but sometimes I like being quiet because it gives me a chance to go inside and go within and say, well, what is it I want to do? And where do I want to go? And what dreams do I want to have this year? And where, you know, blah, blah, blah. So the only way you're going to get to know is if you can quiet down. So if you can go sit out by the water by yourself or go sit by a stream of water by yourself, as long as you're safe, then just get out there and enjoy it. And then just keep a a notepad with you nearby so that you can just write it all down. Because if you don't write it down, you're not going to remember. Trust me. It's going to be gone. Be gone in five minutes. Not even. You'll start talking to somebody and be like, what was that thing I was thinking about? Wow, I had such a good idea. And it's gone forever. Now, maybe it'll pop back if you're lucky. Most times it doesn't because those are those lightning moments that really can be instrumental in changing your life for the better and making things happen. So when I hear those little things or ideas that pop in my way, I'm the first one to write them down. And then the next thing is you need to go act on it. Don't just write it down. You got to act on it because action creates momentum you know, so if it's like that motion, you know, you keep the ball in motion, it'll keep rolling. But if you don't throw the ball in the air, you know, it's just going to hit the ground and it's going to stop rolling. So think about ways that you can just stay motivated while you're having fun this summer so that you're not losing any momentum in moving forward with, with whatever your dreams, goals, desires that you want to achieve. All right, my lifers, remember to live happily, lovingly, successfully, necessarily, and luxuriously. Until the next time. Bye for now. If you like what you hear, tell someone. If you like what you hear, be a dear and pass it on. Don't forget to stop at our website, www.lifesnecessitiesandluxuries.com for more tips, tricks, tutorials to live a very necessary and luxurious life.